Aouj Billahi Mina Shaitan Rajim Bismillahi Rahman Rahim. I think um, I have to agree with the previous speaker that today is a very important occasion. Uh, important in the sense that we are seeing history unfolding. Um, some five years ago, we realized that uh, we've um, 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 gone into elections with the pretext that we were going to build what we call a new Gambia. And this followed, this followed um, a very historic um, elections that brought in um, this, uh, the third republic, which also in, uh, which replaced a very hostile dictatorship. Now, that followed, uh, as a matter of that, we had a cohort of young, determined, um, elected mayors and councillors, and chairpersons, of course, across the country. After five years, we are here again to renew the leaderships that we had in our uh, municipalities and our local our, 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 our area councils. I, in this case, we have our Lord Mayor Talib Ahmad Ben Souda. As the, as the president of Galga, it is my responsibility to give testimony to what has happened in the past. And I think that will help us to see or to focus what will happen as we go in the years ahead. Um, we had witnessed a cohort of young municipal and area council leaders in the past five years. And I think the occasion was not new to any of us. We've seen some tremendous development in the municipalities and the city council as well as the area councils. And in that, I'm sure you all will agree with me, the Carnifi municipality was a pace setter under the leadership, under the dynamic leadership of Mayor Talib Ahmed Ben Souda. As a cohort, we have worked diligently together to change the face of local governance and decentralization in this country. And I think this also is not secret to any of us. So as we set for another four years, it is my belief that the, with the energy we have and with the cooperation of our people, we're going to make more developments or we're going to usher in more developments for our people. I think the Cardiff municipality didn't make any mistake to elect our distinguished mayor, Talib Ahmed Ben Souda. As the president of Galga, I must say, we were able to do as much as we did. Of course, with the enormous and unrelenting support of the Kalifi municipality as the biggest municipality of this country. And, of course, the mayor could not have been left behind. What has happened in more, almost all the local governments across the country the KMC has taken a very decisive role and responsibility to support the process to get us to where we are as local government fraternity. I think you will agree with me, just a little before the elections, we had a case at the Supreme Court which the final decision turned in the favor of the local government authorities to abolish and dismiss the issue of um, um, interim management for local government authorities. This has been a very significant achievement for local governance in this country. I'm sure you will agree with me. In 2018, the Gambia had what we call the National Development Plan. And in the development plan, key among the issues that were supposed to be priorities was effective local governance and decentralization. But that has never taken shape. And I'm sure you will agree with me as well that the local governance reforms has never taken effect. The issues responsible is going to be another story to be told another day. But I'm sure our efforts were recognized by everybody. And this special case I just mentioned 
is one of those that should have been part of the local government reforms. And many, we have many more that should have been done. But I mention this special case because of the role that was played by the Lord Mayor of KMC and the Kalifi municipality, together with other councils, to make sure that there is effectiveness and efficiency in our local government administration in this country. So I'm not seeing anything less, or I'm not forecasting anything less. We just look up to the cooperation of our people to make sure that we deliver to the best of our ability for the interest of the people of our municipalities and our country at large. On that note, I want to request and indulge, of course, on my friend and colleague and my brother, Mayor Talib Ahmed Ben Suda, who has, who has been very effective and hardworking to keep on the good work that he was doing with his team. I have no reservation at all. I have no reservations at all that Tali will do, will, will do just that. I have every belief that he has the energy, he has the wish and will, he has the interest, he has the patriotism with his team to change the face of local governance in this country. And I'm sure with our support and the support of the stakeholders, together we will do it. We owe a lot to the people of this country. And I'm sure our young mayor has recognized that from the onset. That is why he has worked so very hard in the past to make sure that the people of KMC see a whole different municipal council altogether. On that note, as I request and encourage him to keep up with the good work and never be distracted. Never be distracted. And look up to the people of KMC to make sure that together we deliver for our people. On that note, on behalf of the, uh, the local government fraternity of the Gambia, on behalf of Galga and all my colleagues, chairpersons and mayors, I want to congratulate most profoundly our, uh, our councillors elect for KM and also our mayor elect for KM and wish them a very successful tenure of office. Thank you very much.